Edinburgh is well on its way to becoming the space data capital of Europe. Why? Well, the space sector requires lots of different technologies, many of which are being developed right here. From spaceship fuel tanks to clean burn fuel, sensors, robotics and artificial intelligence specifically for use in space. Researchers and industry partners brought together at the Bayes Centre are helping to develop new satellites which gather information about everything from weather patterns to forest biomass and even marine renewable energy. Established experts and new generations of PhD students analyse these data using algorithms which run on the UK's supercomputer, oh, which is also housed here in Edinburgh. But the city has gone much further than that, far out into deep space actually. Thanks to experts at the School of Physics and Astronomy, projects to track space debris and even intercept a comet before it enters our solar system are underway to tell us more about life as we know it. And life as we don't know it could even be on Mars. Edinburgh astrobiologists are conducting experiments on the International Space Station to understand how microbes grow on meteorites. You can even hear Scottish schoolchildren asking questions live to the astronauts aboard the space station thanks to a project Edinburgh helped to bring to life. You can listen to that and so many more stories like it on the podcasts Edinburgh Space Data Capital, Scotland's Secret Space Race and Great British Liftoff. These podcasts, like so much of the space-related work at Edinburgh's universities, Harriet Watt and the University of Edinburgh, were supported by funding from the Data Driven Innovation Programme. Look up, look out and look down on Earth from Edinburgh. Visit ddi.ac.uk.